Hey, good morning and welcome to Wednesday, October 21st, and hope uh, this video finds you well. It's a little bit later than normal. Uh, last night picked up uh, from the airport my wife uh, from the airport and uh, decided to stay down and hit up the world's largest Christmas store on the way back home. So we spent the night down here just so we could hit up Bronner's and looking forward to going in and checking out all the goodies there. Uh, but just so you know, here is my wife. Uh, she is back and alive and well, and she survived California. But uh, more shockingly, I know I survived Michigan without her. And uh, uh, thankful to have uh, to have survived. Th Psalm uh, 37, really quick, uh, and uh, don't want to keep you long here today. But Psalm 37, verse number eight, tells us this: Cease from anger, uh, and forsake wrath. Fret not thyself in any wise to do evil. Uh, and so, as we consider. Uh, this uh, this verse here, uh, the Bible tells us to cease from anger uh, and and uh, forsake wrath. This is uh, something very difficult. Controlling our anger, our emotions, uh, and uh, especially when uh, when we've been wronged and uh, and uh, it's hard for us to set that anger aside and have that forgiving spirit that I believe God would have us to have. Uh, but the challenge here from Psalms or from David here is to cease from anger, forsake wrath. Hey, don't uh, don't return evil with evil, but rather return evil with good, with forgiveness. And it continues, fret not thyself in any wise uh, to do evil. And so uh, there are going to be individuals who who do wrong, who do evil. Uh, but we've got to we've got to stay on the straight and narrow. We've got to continue to do right and continue to live in uh, and with forgiveness in our heart and be gracious, be kind and merciful, uh, and that uh, that must be our desire. Uh, and as we look down here, and uh, we won't uh, look over this today, but uh, just like that next verse says, you know, why, why should we cease from anger? Why should we forsake wrath? Why should we fret, fret not thyself in any wise to be? For evildoers shall be cut off, but those that wait upon the Lord, they shall inherit the earth. And so just remember the, the truth we read in Scripture. Vengeance is mine, I will repay, saith the Lord. So we don't need to live in anger. We don't need to live to get back at somebody, but rather let's live with forgiveness, just trusting God and His plan. Uh, and so I want to encourage you along those lines today, cease from anger uh, and forsake wrath. Fret not thyself for the evildoer. Uh, so leave you with that thought. Hope to see you at church tonight at 6 o'clock for the Rock Ministry for our young people. Also a Bible study and prayer meeting uh, for the adults as well. So. Uh, hope to see you this evening. Also, teenagers, don't forget we've got an activity Friday night uh, at my house beginning at 5 o'clock. And then Saturday, we've got a church cleanup day beginning at 10 o'clock. So keep all that good stuff uh, in mind. If you see behind me, you can see there's a bit of a, a water park back there. And uh, I've never been there. I've been too enthralled with the Christmas store prawners to even think about it. Uh, and so... Uh, we're looking to go and head in there uh, today. But pray for us. We'll be traveling up here uh, in just a few minutes as well. Traveling back home ready for church tonight. Lord bless you. Have a great day, and we'll see you tonight.